Sri Lanka is a pearl-shaped island nation in South Asia. Island is lying on the Indian plate, a major tectonic plate that was formerly part of the Indo-Australian plate. It is in the Indian Ocean southwest of the Bay of Bengal. Between latitudes 5 degrees and 10 degrees north, and longitudes 79 degrees and 82 degrees east. Sri Lanka is separated from the mainland portion of the Indian subcontinent by the Gulf of Manna and Pork Strait. According to Hindu mythology, a land bridge existed between the Indian mainland and the island. It now, amounts to only a chain of limestone shoals remaining above sea level. Legends claim that it was passable on foot up to 1480 C, until cyclones deepened the channel. Portions are still as shallow as 1 meter which equivalent to 3 feet, hindering navigation. The island consists mostly of flat to rolling coastal plains, with mountains rising only in the south-central part. The highest point is Pidura Talagala, reaching 2,524 meters which is, 8,281 feet, above sea level. Country has 103 rivers. The longest of these, is the Mahali River, extending 335 kilometers. These waterways give rise to 51 natural waterfalls of 10 meters which 33 feet or more. The highest is Bambara Kanda Falls, with a height of 263 meters which, 863 feet. Country's coastline is 1,585 kilometers long. The island claims an exclusive economic zone extending 200 nautical miles, which is approximately 6.7 times Sri Lanka's land area. The coastline and adjacent waters support highly productive marine ecosystems, such as fringing coral reefs and shallow beds of coastal and estuarine seagrasses. Sri Lanka has 45 estuaries and 40 lagoons. Island's mangrove ecosystem spans over 7,000 hectares and played a vital role in buffering the force of the waves in the 2004 Indian Ocean tsunami. The island is rich in minerals such as ilmenite, feldspar, graphite, silica, kaolin, mica, and thorium. Existence of petroleum and gas in the Gulf of Manor has also been confirmed, and the extraction of recoverable quantities is underway. Sri Lanka contains four terrestrial eco-regions, lowland rain forests, montane rain forests, dry zone dry evergreen forests, and Deccan Thorn Scrub Forests. Western Ghats of India and Sri Lanka were included among the first 18 global biodiversity hotspots due to high levels of species endemism. The number of biodiversity hotspots has now increased to 34. Sri Lanka has the highest biodiversity per unit area among Asian countries for flowering plants and all vertebrate groups except birds. A remarkably high proportion of the species among its flora and fauna, 27% of the 3,210 flowering plants and 22% of the mammals, are endemic. Sri Lanka supports a rich avifauna that stands at 453 species and this include 240 species of birds that are known to bred in the country. 33 species are accepted by some ornithologists as endemic while some ornithologists consider only 27 are endemic and the remaining 6 are considered as proposed endemics. 
Sri Lanka's protected areas are administrated by two government bodies, the Department of Forest Conservation and the Department of Wildlife Conservation. Department of Wildlife Conservation administrates 61 wildlife sanctuaries, 22 national parks, 4 nature reserves, 3 strict nature reserves, and 1 jungle corridor while Department of Forest Conservation oversees, 65 conservation forests and 1 national heritage wilderness area. Twenty six point five per cent of the country's land area is legally protected. This is a higher percentage of protected areas when compared to the rest of Asia. Among the trees of the dryland forests are valuable species such as satinwood, ebony, ironwood, mahogany, and teak. The wet zone is a tropical evergreen forest with tall trees, broad foliage, and a dense undergrowth of vines and creepers. Subtropical evergreen forests resembling those of temperate climates flourish in the higher altitudes. The Sri Lankan leopard is an endangered subspecies of leopard native to Sri Lanka. Yala National Park in the southeast protects herds of elephant, deer, and peacocks. The Wilpotu National Park in the northwest, the largest national park, preserves the habitats of many water birds, such as storks, pelicans, ibis, and spoonbills. The island has four biosphere reserves, Wundala, Hola Forest Reserve, the Kanalia Dediagala Nakiagnia, and Sinharaja. Sinharaja is home to 26 endemic birds and 20 rainforest species, including the elusive red-faced Malkoa, the green-billed Kokal and the Sri Lanka blue magpie. The untapped genetic potential of Sinharaja flora is enormous. Of the 211 woody trees and lianas within the reserve, 139 66%, are endemic. The total vegetation density, including trees, shrubs, herbs, and seedlings, has been estimated at 240,000 individuals per hectare. The Minaria National Park borders the Minaria Tank, which is an important source of water for elephants inhabiting the surrounding forests. Dubbed the gathering, the congregation of elephants can be seen on the tank bed in the late dry season, August to October, as the surrounding water sources steadily disappear. The park also encompasses a range of micro-habitats which include classic dry zone tropical monsoonal evergreen forest, thick stands of giant bamboo, hilly pastures, and grasslands. During the Mahali program of the 1970s and 1980s in northern Sri Lanka, the government set aside four areas of land totaling 1,900 square kilometers as national parks. Statistics of Sri Lanka's forest cover show rapid deforestation from 1956 to 2010. In 1956, 44.2% of the country's land area had forest cover. Forest cover depleted rapidly in recent decades, 29.6% in 1999, 28.7% in 2010. The end of part 1 of the Sri Lanka. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, like and share. Thank you.